Whoa, 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 whoa. Here they come, Hunley. <laughs> Hunley forgot today was the day they promised to take George out on their neat, orderly boat. Your buddy George is coming aboard, Hunley. <laughs> oh. We're both excited about this. We even bought matching life vests. <laughs> you guys look very snappy. Let's stow your stuff, George. <laughs> Here we go. Should it do that? No. We better head home before it gets worse. Sorry, guys. Oh. Hundley was relieved. The sooner they got home, the less George could make a mess of things. <laughs> if we stop at Wilson's Island, I can reinforce the boom so we can sail back without worrying. Great. <laughs> yeah, that is weird. Palm trees don't grow in this part of the world, do they? No. Mr. Wilson brought in rocks, shells, and trees from the tropics to create an exotic island home. Wow. So Mr. Wilson lives here? No, he never moved in. So now it's a deserted tropical island, like you read about. <laughs> Wilson brought that, too. There's nowhere else like this within 5,000 miles of here. Come on. Let's get some wood, leaves, and vines to reinforce the boom. George needed to get up high so he could see far. <sighs> Those trees could only mean one thing. <laughs> Footprints meant feet. Feet meant people. Because you don't see a lot of feet on their own. Do we have enough logs? I don't know how many more I can drag. We need more. <sighs> oh, thanks, George. George? <laughs> <laughs> Look who found me! Look who found me! Oh, Hunley, I thought you were lost. Um. You wouldn't happen to have my boat with you, would you? <laughs> Next stop, home sweet home. Hold it! <gasps> my yellow 